Hey everybody, Mr. Miola here and welcome back to Birthdays The Beginning. Last episode was a really big one. We went and threw down a heat wave on the world. We destroyed everything. We just pumped up the world to 60 degrees Celsius where everything decided to die and we started a new world. So here we are in a, I think it's a large world. I still think there is another size above this, but I ain't ready to go that far into it. But last episode we went, we got started, we... We created a new world, and here we are. We've just started getting some new creatures in our world as well. We're starting to get a lot of these Stromolotites and all sorts of little things. We've got a couple of mountains over there in the distance as well that aren't doing a whole lot, but don't worry, don't worry, we'll get there. We've got a lot of room to play with this time, so I guess we'll expand as we go. But the next step that we have to tackle is making some deep oceans so that we can get the creatures that we need to finally get some dinosaurs going. When I say finally, I mean, hey, we're moving pretty quick already, so there's probably not a sense of finally or anything like that. But let's go. We're gonna first start, first thing we're going to do, I guess, is create ourselves a bigger sea. We need a bigger ocean to begin with. And once we have a bigger ocean, then we can go deep oceans. We got this though, don't worry, don't worry, we got this. But right now we just got a whole lot of shallows and you don't need too much shallows. We'll go and dig this a little bit further down. Poor oh, man, we better start getting some levels pretty quick because we can't do a whole lot of movement every time. I don't know, like look at that. We've already got like 500 movement left. Let's go drop. Well, let's see how far we can get this down anyway. Not far, oh no, we are. That's a deep sea. So we may be deep enough to see some growth. Let's have a look. No. Anything wanna, anything wanna spawn into our, no, Dinorthus, they're kind of struggling a little bit. What's our temperature, by the way? I didn't even pay attention to our air temperature right now. Let's go speed things up like super duper fast. The Dinorthus are struggling. It might be too hot for them. I don't even know if we need them. In fact, you know what? We should probably go and check our library. What do we need? So we're heading down this direction. We got these guys last episode for the first time yet, which was awesome. Really, really good. Um, those are Dinorthus. So we are going to need to keep our Dinorthus at 49 degrees in the shallows. Fair enough. But we want to get... No, we've got those guys. We've got those guys. We've got those guys. We need these guys. In a sea of under 45 degrees, we can get them. It's all good. We're also going to need these. No, we don't. We've already got them. We need these guys right here. The deep sea. 31 degrees in the deep sea. Okay. Well, to get that, I think we're going to have to cool down the world just a tiny little bit. So, to counter all of our, our digging, we're going to have to build some big old mountains. And I guess we're going to do exactly that. So, we're just going to, like, go ham on this thing. Um, I guess just, just, just go and raise it all up. You raise me up. I'm not even going to try singing. I'm sorry. I apologize for that. I... I sincerely apologize for the attempted singing. I will never do it again. Ever. I promise you. Well, there we go. That's our mountain range. I hope you like it. Um, we're going to have to zoom out. Regenerate some health. We should really put a mountain in the middle of the world, shouldn't we? That's what we probably should do, but we'll see how we go. Still nothing spawning in. Our world is still way too hot, I think. We're going to need, what was it, like 23 degrees underwater. We'll get there, don't you worry. We'll get there. So, 45 degrees still. 45 degrees. I kind of want to drop this further down. But... It's already 42 degrees down. Yeah, no. Yeah, it's probably... Yeah, we probably can't really do that. Can I move faster? This is as fast as we can move. This this just ain't gonna cut it. It's not gonna cut it. Well, no, go up. What are you doing? What are you doing? No, nope, there we go. Okay, okay. Let's get these canyons going. That's what we should do. We should build some canyons. So you know what? We're going to go along here, along this far edge of our world. This is just horrible. This, this is the worst world building I think we've ever done. But it's okay. We'll get there. Don't worry. We'll get there. A little bit more times. We'll let this health regenerate and we'll jump straight back in and do it all over again. All right. So we're down to 40 degrees, except this time what I'm going to do differently is I'm going to drop a blizzard down on this world. There we go. That should cool everything down. Just a tiny little bit extra. Let's go! Let's see how this thing goes. Are we going to get our new fish out or what? Our Dinorthus are finally increasing in population. We were killing them off accidentally, but that's okay. We really just need our Colanthuses. We probably need a bigger deep sea, to be honest, but that's okay. We'll get to that now. We'll get to that now. So we're going to 37 degrees. That's nice. But we also got to go and probably... Oh, we got to dig this deeper. It's still 43 degrees down here. Problem is, oh no, it is getting colder. The problem is, like, it it increases the population of the whole world. But it, it decreases, no, not the population, the temperature. 
Is it? Oh, wow. I just realized the cube doesn't just... It doesn't just broaden. It goes up and down as well. We can go so deep with this sea. It is ridiculous. How high are mountains can we get then? That's crazy. I guess we can go pretty high up. So, um, we're going to do that. <laughs> let's go and let's go right up then, shall we? Let's go right along this wall. We'll hug. Okay, I guess. I guess not. But what we are going to do, one last thing before we zoom back out of the world. I'm going to go drop a little ice crystal. That's right. The 20, 20, I reckon the 20 degree one. Nope, only the 10 degree one. So this little guy over here. And hopefully that'll make it cold enough for our cold to start spawning. There we go. There we go. There we go. There's our coal. We've got the coal in the world. And from coal, everything comes. The Wapioids, for example. Who else are you going to give me? Who else are you going to give me? Or is that it? We're just going to get those two for now. I guess once their populations increase, then, then the ball will start rolling. Or maybe right now? Right? Okay, not yet. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. That's okay. That's all right. I'll take that. I'll take that. All right. So what are we going to do? I think what we should do is start broadening this into a nice big flat area. And the way we're going to do that is we're going to use some of these items. We're going to use these ones right here. We have 47 of them. And the way we're going to do that, we're going to go, boop, and there we go. And then I'm going to, then I'm going to move over here and I'm going to do the exact same thing. Right, right, right there. There we go. I want a nice big flat area up here. And then we'll go and like lift the rest as we go. But this is all just, you know, just to get, get the ball rolling, you know. We've got 43 of these items, so we may as well get a nice big flat area this way. And then we'll we'll go and do it the other way. There we go. Okay. So we're starting to get a nice big flat area. And up here, what I'm actually going to do is get a nice big river going up the top here as well. And then um, I guess... I guess the sky's the limit after you start doing that sort of stuff. Then we can start getting some rivers going through the world. We're going to start getting some grass out here as well. It's all just going to come together piece by piece, basically. Let's uh, increase this height as well. It's just really ugly. <laughs> I'm trying to get it a little bit more tidy. I guess I don't even need to. I guess I can just raise it all a little bit. Kind of just ruined it all. All right, so I've gone and used up all that I can use up once again. Let's go ahead and zoom out. We still don't have a river up there or any other water for that for that matter, but we'll get there. Don't you worry, we will get there. I just got to go and raise a bit more land, drop a little river source down. I don't know. I don't know. It's actually really hard to build a really pretty world, to be honest, especially when we're not getting any new creatures. Are we want to get anything or what? We got the Colanthuses. It doesn't stop there. We got to get more. Wofioroids as well. Okay. All right. All right. All right. We're going back in. We're going back in. It's okay. We'll get there. The dinosaurs will avenge themselves. They will return to the earth. We've got these guys now. We can go down this direction. The Latin Americas, but we have to get a really cold deep sea to get them. In fact, 25 to 31 degrees in a deep sea to get the coals. Fair enough. Fair enough. We need seas to get these guys. And then to get the Ichiostegas, we need land under 33 degrees. So I guess... That's where we're heading. And we're currently moving from 39 to 31 degrees. So we will get there. We will get there. But for now, what I'm thinking is we go and... I don't really want to expand on the deep sea down there. But what I am going to do is, um, I guess, a bit of this type of action. I want to go to like something like this. I just want to work my way... Damn it. <laughs> I kind of ruined it all. I kind of ruined it all. I don't want to be affecting those bottom parts. And I've gone and done exactly that. Whoops. Come on, I just want to get some more natural looking land. Is that too much to ask? I'm not doing a very good job of it. I'm doing a horrible job of it. It's okay. We'll get there though. We'll get there. Um. All right, so we have a little bit of a bigger sea now, which is nice. What I think we should go up and do before we zoom out again though, is get a river source going. That way we can actually get some, some nice areas around the world. So what we're going to have to do, we're going to have to go, I'm thinking we go and lift this up a little bit. Oh, I don't actually know if we're going to get it done this episode. Because I want to get a waterfall going over here, but I don't think we're going to. We're going to run out of HP. No. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. What's the rush? We'll get there sooner or later. Let's go, though. Let's go. Hopefully see some new things spawn in. Or not. Why is the temperature increasing? It's supposed to be decreasing. We've got to get down to that 33 degree optimal limit. Where's it at? Why aren't we getting it? No, not quite. The co Everything's increasing. Bit by bit. Okay. That's okay. That's okay. 
We'll get there. We'll get there. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. Now, let's go expand our thing in my bubby again. And I think we go up to about this height. All right. We're going to go up to this height. And then, ooh, a bit too much. Then I think we're going to do the same out here. Oh, hold on. There we go. That's the way I want it. And I'm thinking we stop about there. And then with this part, we're going to come up to the same height again. Stop about there. And then this part here, I think we're going to raise up all the way. And this one here is going to go to about there. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to go drop a river source. Uh, where are we going to find that? Oh, here we go. We got 52 of them. You kidding me or what? Perfect. Perfect. Beautiful. Amazing. Now, I guess we're going to go and drop it all. No, drop it. Hey, there we go. We got some grass as well. Fantastic. That's what we want to see, baby. That's what we want to see. And there we go. We're going to flow down into a river down here as well. And this might get funny because we're going to have to go and lift this up as well. We can't, we can't really go down here because it'll turn into an ocean. And we don't really want that. But that's it. Now we zoom out. The river's going to start doing river things and let water start flowing, hopefully. The only thing is that might have increased the temperature of the world. That's the downside of what we just did. The more water we got, the hotter the world gets. The more land we got, the cooler the world gets. We might have actually got too much of an ocean. Yeah, now that I think about it, that could be a problem. But it's okay. We'll cross that bridge when we get to it. At least we've got a bit of a river going now. And we can, you know, eventually we'll start making it look all pretty and stuff. But for now, I'm quite happy with how it is. Let's go, though. I want to raise this up a little bit. I kind of want to get a little bit... I just want to make it look nice and pretty, basically. <laughs> but not too pretty. We'll get pretty eventually, don't you worry. All right, so I just went and added a little bit of like a mountain range over the side here. I think it looks really cool. I hope you guys do as well. And I think we're just going to top this whole section over here off by following it through all the way to the back of the wall, back of the world, back of the cube, whatever we're calling this thing. Um, and then we're going to go and bump this up a little bit further. I wish it didn't increase by that much so I could just, you know, like... Bump up this whole little corner over here without going too far out here, but I don't even know. It's all happening. It's all happening anyway. It's getting better. It's looking good. I like it. I hope you guys do as well. Oh, man, we got this whole section over here as well. Okay. Well, let's go and bump all this up as well then, I guess. I didn't realize how far back our little thing, QB, thing of my bobby went. Um, drop you down. No, I want you down a little bit. And a little bit more. Okay. Well, it's all starting to come together. Unfortunately, we don't have grass growing up here, and I have no idea why that is. What if we drop this down? Will it? Oh, that's right. No! I want water. There we go. Good. Okay, I wasn't sure if we're going to need another river source there or not. Um, and now, eventually... Oh, basically, we can keep on going. We can make, like, a little... A big old pool over here. So, let's go. We're going to go up by one. I'm going to sort of open up a big section over here, and it's going to open up a big river down at the bottom. A big... Freshwater river that we can get a bunch of crocodiles and stuff like that sort of swimming around once they decide to spawn into our world whenever they decide to do that I don't know when that's gonna be they, they seem to be taking their sweet sweet time um, Okay, oh, I've run out of okay. We've run out of stuff Let let the, let the time continue. Let's see Ski at your phones. Nope. Are we getting them? Are they staying? Are they going? Can't really tell not a lot's happening. Can some stuff start happening, please? I guess, I guess not. Things aren't ready to start happening, I suppose. That if we speed it up real quick. What happens that real quick? What happens then? Heliophyllums! That's all we're gonna get. <laughs> oh, here we go! It's your stingers! We did it! We did it! We finally, finally, finally! I'm, I'm trying to find where he is. We do have dinosaurs somewhere. Where is the little guy? I, I, it, it popped up on my list. Where they at? We have land dinosaurs, it said. <gasps> Unless they're... Are they still water dinosaurs? Are Ichiostegas water things? Where they at? They're down here. They're not down here. Where's our little coals? Okay, we got fish down there. But I don't know where our little dinosaurs went. We supposedly have dinosaurs. That's okay, though. That's okay. We're going to keep on, I guess, terraforming this whole area over here. Have it suitable for more dinosaurs. And then we'll let it rip and we'll see what happens. So... Okay, I kind of like this sort of area. It's it's looking pretty cool. Um, like I said, we will make it look less blocky and annoying like that eventually. But for now, this is looking quite nice. I think maybe I'm going to go one more up with a lot of this. 
All right, so now we have a nice big area. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go drop a, ooh. No, we might, I was gonna say we're gonna drop another river source down, but I don't think we will. I'm just gonna go drop a large chunk like this down. And then we're gonna work our way sort of around like this. There we go. So it's, it's, it looks a bit funky, I know that, but it's a nice big freshwater lake that eventually is gonna look bloody awesome. It's gonna look real. Actually, you know what? I like this. I like the shape of this. You know what? I think we're gonna keep that shape. I think we're gonna keep that. Um, we're gonna keep it a little, little bit of a, like a flat edge around it as well. And then I'm gonna go bump these little edges up as well. Like so. And then we can sort of get like... I don't know. I don't know. We'll have, we'll have little creatures kind of living in this little... Gro we'll call it the grotto. This part of the map is called the grotto. But oh, and then we go run out of HP anyway. So let's go zoom out. Let time fly by. We have Climatiuses. Awesome. Hopefully we can. We've lost our Elderathias though. We've lost our Animalulucaruses. We've got Codium Fragiles. I don't even know what they are. Okay, now the things are coming in. Dimetrodons, for example. We have ourselves. Our first dinosaurs. The dinosaurs are back, baby. The dinosaurs are coming back. Okay, let's get back in there. We've got too many new things. Let's find, let's have a look. What do we got? We've got a bunch of trees. All right. We have ourselves, our dinosaurs back. Hey there, buddy. You're the first ever dinosaur. You're going to be the first one to rule the world. It's going to be awesome. What about these other guys that were supposed to have spawned? The Ichiostegas. What happened to them? They, they came into the world and then they just never like appear. They never showed me where they are. And finally, we got some grass growing up here as well. That's what I like to see. But again, I have no idea where my Ichiostegas are. Where are the Ichiostegas? Where are they at? They're not even over here. That's okay. Maybe we've gone too cold. You know what we have? It's 29 degrees. Yeah. Oh no, we want this to go down. Oh, I've run out of... Wow, I've run out of stuff. This is gonna be bad. Hopefully we don't kill anything while we let time pass by. It's 29 degrees. It should be around the mid thirties. I think if we want like dinosaurs to inhabit the world, instead we're gonna get trees. I'm fine with trees. Trees are cool. Horneophytons, calamites. Keep them coming. We want as many species as we can possibly get. Let's go in, let's go in. Okay, so I kind of messed up a little section out here. It's currently 27 degrees going to 28. That's not good. That's not what we want. I want to drop this. No, I want to drop it. Drop it down. 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 We've got to expand our sea a little bit. There we go. Much better. Much better. Much better. Um, and then we're going to do the same over here. I'm going to go like this. Um, I'm going to drop this down. Nope. We want this to go downwards. Down. Oh, and I've run out again. Well, at least we're starting to get some, like, elevation. Oh, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Stay back out. Get back out. Get back out. I want to go change the world up a little bit. At least we can get some elevation going. Maganuras. We've got insects. I swear it took so long for us to get them last time, but I might just be, you know, memorizing this all wrong. I thought it took a long time for it to, for us to get them. I still haven't found our Ichiostegas. We have Ichiostegas in the world because I just saw it, but... I haven't actually spotted any living in our world. Aren't they supposed to be little green guys? I ain't seen any little green guys around. <laughs> what happened to them? They gotta be around somewhere. It tells me that they're here somewhere. I just don't know where they are. Anyways, let's keep dropping this stuff down. So, yep, that's exactly what we're gonna do. We're gonna go nice and deep. Um, drop this little section down over here. And I reckon we get a nice flat section going as well. There we go. I love it. Oh, I want you to go back up and I want you to go down. There we go. All right, so the world's all starting to come together. It's starting to look like an actual world. I'm not used to this whole big world thing. The big world game is, it's a lot tougher to play with than the small world thing, but it's, it's slowly happening. It's slowly happening. Oh, hold on just a second. We've got little fresh water. Yes! Okay, that's why we got Meganeera so early, because we've got rivers and lakes and stuff. We also got these little fellas, what are they called? Clematiuses. I think it took a long time for us to get these last time, because it took so long for us to work out how to build a river, because we weren't that bright, but it's happening now. We're getting better at this. It's finally all coming together. I hope this grass spreads a little bit more. In fact, you know what I'm going to do? 
We're going to go and get like a little bit of a mountaintop river going up here as well. Or lake. A lake type area. Nope, we want to go down with that. There we go. Um, oh, yeah. It's going to be like this. Yes. It's going to look awesome. And then we'll go and raise this up a little bit. No, too much. I didn't want that much up. Like that. Beautiful. Beautiful. And then we can go and like run rivers side by side. So this is going to come down. And this is going to sort of come down. I think. Like that. We're going to expand a big section over here too. And then we can kind of raise up a little chunk here. Raise up a little chunk here. And then we can go and drop like that. And now we have like a, an another lake, I guess. Another type of lake section over here. Yeah, this is great. It's all coming together. Oh, I've run out again. That's okay. We'll zoom out. We'll let it run one more time. We'll see if anything new wants to spot into our world. And if it doesn't, then so be it. So be it. We'll keep manipulating our world until it does. It doesn't look like much more is coming in, unfortunately. It looks like we may have reached our limit here, eh? We're not oh, here we go. The Philippus And then right as my camera turns off, we get like three new species on top of all of that. Here we go. Now it's all coming in. Primal butterflies, Velocurus. We got to go in and have a look. Have a look. Have a look. Have a look. I don't even know. Yeah, we got all our like insects living over here now. <laughs> it's all starting to come together. We got a bunch of fish in here. We've got, do we have any fish up here as well? Do we have anything up here? We got some flowers. I think the bell flowers grow up there. We got some more fishy growing in our new little lake down here. And okay, I thought there was like something sticking out of the ground over there, but there wasn't. We've still got our Demetrodon. He's kind of just doing his own thing. I don't really know. I don't really know what he's doing. He's obviously not breeding into different new species. And I still have no idea where our poor little Ichio Stega is. I just haven't been able to find him. He's just nowhere to be seen. But for now, we are going to wrap this episode up here. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Birthdays in the Beginning. If you're excited for this new world, then make sure to let me know by punching the thumbs up. Make it rain those thumbs ups. And I'll catch you on the next one very, very soon. Bye for now.